principal aim of the English department is the development and refinement of communication skills, reading, writing, talking and listening. These encourage independence of thought, social skills and raise the confidence of our pupils. We've recently broadened our curriculum to include media texts up to national qualification level for the first time. We haven't forgotten about the classics, of course, and we teach literary heritage texts. And as of next year, every pupil will be taught a Shakespearean text at least once during their time in the English department. We also have a bespoke S1 debating unit that we'll be delivering that has been created by former debating captain Callum Duffy. And I'm going to pass over to Grace now, who's going to talk more about debating and public speaking in the school. Um, hi, my name is Grace Woodhouse and I'm the debating and literacy captain um, this year. Debating is obviously a huge part of the school community and in both the junior and senior schools, all pupils are encouraged to develop their skills in debating and public speaking. And as well as that, they also have the opportunity to take part in lots of competitions. So, for example, we have in-school competitions such as the Interhouse Debating and the Interhouse Public Speaking. We also compete in local competitions such as the McKinstry Debate, which um, happens each year. And we also go all the way up to national debates such as Law Society and the English Speaking Union Debating Competitions. Public speaking is also a huge part of um, the English department here. There is the Old Girls competition which runs each year and there's also a public speaking competition which is open to third year pupils. Pupils can also receive coaching from both ex-pupils such as Callum Duffy, the former debating captain, and also companies that come in to just share their knowledge. The English teachers are really well informed and experienced in our department. We all mark for the SQA, we all moderate pupils' work regularly throughout the year in line with national standards and of course we all work really hard to devise creative lessons for all pupils at an appropriate level of challenge. We believe this is what accounts for our excellent results year on year and Grace is going to elaborate on some of the, uh, the writing initiatives that we have in the department as well. Mm, there's a lot of creative writing opportunities within the English department and a lot of the students' work can be entered into competitions so we have the school competition, which is the McDonald uh, Creative Writing Prize, and that is awarded each year with a trophy at Speech Day. We also enter more national competitions, such as the Sir Walter Scott Historical Fiction Prize, and that is open to all third years within the school. Um, as well as that, fantastic pupil essays that have been completed in class are also recognised and awarded with our essay of the month and that gets put up on the wall and students are rewarded for excellent work. Alongside that we also go on theatre trips throughout the school year and there's a book club that also runs. So as you can see English touches on many areas, social, moral, cultural and it's really through the exploration of all these issues, developing the communication skills along the way that really enables pupils to attain their best in exams and set them up for every success in later life.